Hey guys, Stagger at 1331 here, bringing you the second Random Survival All-Star Tournament. Now, you're probably expecting the fourth uh, Random Survival Tournament, but I decided to just continue that series, and I'll tell you why. First reason is because I got rid of a lot of my crappy characters, so as a result, you were pretty much seeing the same same ones anyway. And number two, I like doing it this way a little better, um, uh, because the way I used to do it definitely, uh, it took a lot longer to do it, and um, it was definitely much more time-consuming. So, as a result, I like doing it this way better. Oh, and also, I actually ended up getting rid of um, two people that were originally on the All-Star roster. They were Storm by Kong and also Magneto by Kong, and the main reason for that was because of their shields. I just found that a lot of my people just could not beat them. I mean, there are there are a number that can, but... I mean, I mean, even characters like Metal Kigio and Guts lose more often than Magneto and uh, Storm, so... At that point, I'm figuring, you know what, whatever. I mean, it, you know, that's that 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 just that just makes it that just gives more of my people chance. So at any rate, let us begin. Johnny Cage. Ooh, wow, that's Krang. Oh, oh, oh man, what a duo that is, Blossom and Krang. Wow. That duo has some potential right there, guys. Blossom and Krang, it's Johnny Cage and Ravage. Oh boy, this should be a really good fight, man. Go Blossom and Krang all the way. Oh my god, what a mean combo that was, the boy to kick ass. Freeze beam. Another uppercut, he's toast. Nice uppercut to finish it. Oh man, these two are for real, guys. Blossom and Krang. Oh, that's mean. Freeze him and then just get him in the uppercut. It's so mean, but at the same time, it always puts a smile on my face. Oh, boomerang. Yeah, that's weird. I wonder why that one failed. Yeah, it must have been blocking. Oh god, crying army, crying army, crying army alert. Johnny Cage is down. Oh god, he hit his toes. He's gone. Beautiful finish on Blossom and Crane. Okay, that music with the spinning light is freaking awesome. I love that. What, afraid of a little girl? It's funny, her music with that with that spinning light is actually pretty kick-ass. I like that a lot. Oh man, I hope we see a lot of wins from these two, man. Boy, these two have some serious potential. Blossom and Krang. Wow, that was freaking cool. Uh, I must say, I'm gonna like these two, so uh, hold on just a second, I'll cue them up. Okay, hey guys, welcome back once again, bringing you the second battle of the first round with Blossom and Krang as the duo to beat. Let's see who they get now. Oh my god, showed up. And Cat, oh my god. What an un- Oh my, this battle is going to be sick, guys. This is going to be an uber intense one right here. Freaking showing up and cat. Like, oh my god. I would be so happy if Blossom and Crank can win this one. Well, frankly, I'll be happy if either one wins, but still, showing up and cat, that's a, that's a tough one. Oh god. The master! Ah, ah. My god, this is so close, guys. Oh no, nice, nice counter uppercut. Oh god. About the shack attack, about the shack attack, about the shack attack. Oh 
Jeez. Oh man, I don't think Boston's gonna come out of this one alive. Oh my god, maybe she will come out of this one alive. Oh my god. Oh no, no. I think, yep, she's gone. Oh man, Kat just barely won that one for her side. Oh my god. Come on, Boston and Curry, push us to round three. Or at least come close, because I'll be happy either way. Yeah, that's a fail on your part, Sherlock. You, you were caught right in that attack. Ooh, wow, beautiful dive bomb. Oh my god, boss is gone. It's all up to Clang now. Nice counter. Oh, wow. That's it. Krang is dead. Cat and Shona take this battle 2-0. to zero. Wow. Wow, what, what an incredible fight to the finish that was, man. Tony, as powerful as Blossom and Krang is, boy, Cat and Shona is, for all intents and purposes, that actually is a better, more skilled duo even than Blossom and Krang. Unbelievable work from Cat and Shona, man. And of course, and just when I thought that Blossom and Krang are going forever, here here, here comes Cat and Shona. Well, well, I'm kind of happy Shona finally made his debut in one of my tournaments. Well, well, made a tournament debut. I mean, hopefully he'll recover better than when he got freaking A-bombed to death a few battles ago with uh, Captain Falcon. Oh, well, um, uh, hold on just a second, I'll cue that up. Uh, hey guys, welcome back, bringing you the third battle of the second Random Survival All-Star Tournament. Cat and Shona are still, still due to be here. Let's see what we have. <gasps> Holy crap, it's the clones! Lizard Man and the Rock Sour clones. Wow. And the Leroy Green I'm looking for is a little punk who thinks he's a kung fu master. Get ready to keep butt. <laughs> <laughs> Beautiful, beautiful win by Cat and Shodoff, man. Those clones are not easy to beat in the least. Of course, they have full bars are special, too. Look how freaking fast that special can go up. That is retarded. Go! 
that's it. Wow, two zero over the Long Island Pones and Lizard Man. Wow, this duo is for real. Holy crap, Cat and Shodaf. Damn, what 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 a showing of power do these two have? Well, well, let's see what battle number four yields, which will be coming up next. Okay, all right, here we are with battle number four. Let's see who they get now. Of course, the Rockstar clones could even stop these two. Oh God, Milia, she might. And Chaos and Milia, holy crap! Moo just pulling out all the stops against these two, man. Am I the Go around. Who am I? Who am I? I can't hear you. Shogun of Harlem. Oh yeah, this is gonna be a nice one right here, guys. This is gonna be an awesome one. I mean, you see how fast you can get the fucking special up? It's retarded. They literally can't get a freaking movement at all to save their lives. <laughs> Romantic. Bam. Whoa, ho, ho. wow, nice one by N Chaos. Oh man, look at how close they came. That that's unreal. Wow. They did they came even closer than the clones. And that's and that is freaking ridiculous when when you think of that. That's a, that's a, that's the thing you gotta do with these two. You, you gotta come up with a special attack at the start of the match. There ain't, there ain't no two ways about that one, man. Oh god, not the die bomb. Oh wow, that actually didn't affect anyone. Oh god, Sean's gone! Cat can still win this though. Oh wow, just barely won that one. Man, look at how close and Chaos and Milia came in round in both rounds. That is that is that is just ill right there, man. Holy crap, showing up and cat are for real. And of course, after being really and thoroughly pummeled and quickly pummeled by eight by a bomb when he was a Captain Falcon in um, uh, in one of my recent battles, yeah, you could tell Shoref had to had to be hungry for revenge. And believe me, he's getting it. He's getting it. I mean, believe me, he won't be seeing a bomb here. And thank God, because he wouldn't be able to do anything to him anyway, to be honest. So at any rate, um, here comes battle number five. Okay, guys, welcome, welcome back. Here comes battle number five. Halfway through the first round. Dalson and Satsuki. Yeah, much more mild manner than the last few we've been seeing. What group is that? Okay, this is angry. I thought that was S group. I was like, oh boy. Oh wow, he actually got knocked out of that. Oh wow, look at that Suki Dawson go, man. That's not bad. Wow, they're actually doing a good amount of damage to show them. I'm, I'm impressed. Oh god. Smack, smack, smack. Ground pound. Oh man. Yeah, Shoda sure wasn't gonna have wasn't gonna, wasn't gonna have any of that, man. I think because he actually died. He, he actually died in the last fight. Oh man, Tony, I love these two. Cat and showed up, man. Just whipping up, whipping up my loss to the shreds, man. Oh, 
Oh god, he's down. Wow. Wow. In freaking incredible, man. These two are definitely for real. Yeah, Satsuki and Dallison did okay in the first round, but Satsuki needed a much better partner to counter the likes of these two. Well, that being said, here comes battle number six. Uh, hey guys, welcome back. Bringing you battle number six of the first battle, uh, first round, should say. Oh, wow, I think, I believe that that might be Donatello. Yuko Saigiji? Oh no, that's um, uh, Leonardo, I think. Yep, yeah, Leonardo. I love the way the crowd looks for just because of the way the foreground is. It's kind of funny. Alright. Yuko and Leonardo. Wow, man. The Shogun is back on the scene, and the Shogun is the master. Mm-hmm, indeed. Wow, very nice, clean, convincing win on that one, round one. Oh, wow, wow, nice counter. It is possible to counter showing up out of his ooze, but damn, is that hard to do. Oh, so that's almost dead. Oh my god, Shola is dead. It's all, it's, all, it's all only between Kat and Kat and Yuko now. Oh wow, so Shola actually died in that one. That's impressive. Because that, that is definitely one of Shodov's biggest weaknesses is projectiles. Because Shodov lives, and I mean lives, off of close range. If you, I mean, I mean it, believe me, if we had a duo that involved, let's just say, like, well, I don't know, like, Rusheka and, like, Ronald McDonald or someone like that, who, like, who, who's really, really good with projectiles, then showing up, and showing up is greatly hindered. I, I don't know, I don't know, I mean, I wouldn't go as far as to say totally, um, beaten, but he's definitely, um, hindered some. Alright, so, with that said, um, uh, here comes the seventh battle, just a bit. Alright, alright, guys, welcome back to the second random survival all-star tournament with battle number seven. Here we go, guys. Hmm, I believe that that is Helion and Wonder Woman. Wow, that's a good one. Oh no, my bad. That's Riot. Riot and Wonder Woman. And the Leroy Green I'm looking for is a little punk who thinks he's a kung fu master. Get ready to keep butt. Wow, wow, wow! Beautiful, beautiful Wonder. Um, uh, beautiful Wonder Whip uh, counter. Oh God. Wow, nice counter from Riot. Damn, I thought I thought that would have got grabbed out of that, man. The thing with Wonder, Wonder is a counter expert. She can counter you almost out of anything she wants. And show them this freaking dead, guys. About the shack attack, about the shack attack. Oh boy. Power of my magic lasso. 
Oh god. Oh god, one of them is down. It's all between Walt, Riot, Riot, and Cat. Oh no. Oh no. Oh my god! Look at that. I think one of them and Riot should have won that one. What are you thinking, Riot? You should have done a long range attack. Although, then again, with her head, I don't think anything would have hit. But wow. Oh god, not this attack already. Oh wow, one of them actually broke out of that. Oh wow! Wow, she freaking broke him out of that. That was pretty cool. She lassoed him out of the dive bomb attack. Oh man, that's it. Two zero or the woman in riot. The Shogun is back on the scene, and the Shogun is the master. Wow, incredible work from Wonder Woman and Riot. What an impressive showing that was. Man, wow, what a steely duo that is, man. To, to, to actually almost beat Cat and show up in a round. Think they did. They they almost did. Think, think they almost did it. And if they did, I could say that they would have done something that the Rock Tower clones and Lizard Man could not even do. That is crazy. Wow. Well, that being said, um, stay tuned for the eighth battle, which will be coming up in just a bit. Hey guys, welcome back, bringing you the 8th battle of the of the first round of the 2nd Random Survival All-Star Tournament. Here we go. These two will be getting some awesome duos. Oh god, that's Kanai and Noel. That's not bad. Now, Kanai is a very interesting opponent because cause she can she can counter you very very easily from the air with, with her grabs. Well, that is Douglas Adams. Like, see, like, look at that. Like, see how she just countered him like that? Bit slap. Pound to the ground. Punch him away. That's how you do it, show enough. Rest until everybody knows. Shogun is the master! Get ready to keep butt and get it. <laughs> I thought it was going to be a flawless victory at first. Oh wow, that failed. Wow, damn near a flawless victory in round two. Wow. Incredible right there, guys. Man, that was almost a flawless freaking victory, man. So close. Well, well, all that being said, stay tuned for the ninth battle, which will be coming up in just a bit. Uh, hey, guys, welcome back. Bringing you the ninth battle of the first round of the second round Survival All-Star Tournament. Here we go with Cat and Shona, still working my roster's shreds. The Silver Surfer and Shion. I got something real for your ass and me. Mm, this could be interesting. I don't know if they'll do that great, but, um, yeah. Silver, the Silver Server has a couple of interesting tricks up his sleeve, so you never know. Of course, Shion's pretty powerful. Oh, God. Damn near falls victory in round one. Wow, Shona, Shona didn't even get touched at all. 
Beautiful win in round two. Another near falls victory. Man, I'm surprised they haven't got more falls yet. Believe me, I'm sure. I'm sure they. I'm sure they'll probably get a couple, especially if they get such a duo such as like Wario and Homer Simpson or something like that. Well, all that being said, here comes the final battle of the first round of the second random survival all star tournament coming up in just a bit. Uh, okay, guys, welcome back. Bringing you the final battle of the first round. Here we go. Giga Bowser and Shadow Kamek! Oh my god! Which is a, this is a pretty ironic duo. Cause cause they're both they're both Mario villains. I hate to say it though, because I still think Cat and Shoda can, can pull this shit off. And they really, 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 really put their minds to it to beat Giga Bowser first, then I I'd say they have a chance at this. Beating Giga Bowser is not gonna be easy though. Because he has a pension for uh, for for releasing some ultra powerful attacks. That's it, tail. Wow, wow! Look at Shadow Cam coming back in the second uh, tournament. Of course, he appeared in the first tournament with Necro, and they only got five wins. His assist are gone! No way, dude! Looks like Shadow Cannon might lose this one. Oh my god. That's it. Cannon showing up, take round one. Or I should say round two, rather. So wow, they are still in this thing, and Shadow Cannon's assists are gone and not coming back. Oh, this is it, man! If they can beat Shadow Cannon and Giga Bowser now, then they'll then they'll still remain ongoing. Wow, how the hell they get counter out? Oh god! Oh yeah, I forgot that Shadow Cannon can hurt his partner. I forgot about that. Oh my god. I think Cat and Shown have got this unless Gigabyte can, can, can come up with a rip roaring attack at the last second, man. And that's it. Holy freaking crap. Cat and Shona. Cat and Shona. Beat Shadow Kamek and Giga Bowser. So Shadow Kamek um, uh, was able to succeed in the first turn, but not this time. Not this time, guys. However, he might come back, but um, uh, still. Un 
unbelievable, man. Incredible, incredible showing of pure steeliness from Cat and Shonuff. And even from earlier duos such as Blossom and Krang. Man, absolutely incredible. Love it. Absolutely love every minute of this. This is freaking awesome. You got you, you got to love you got to love this. There ain't there ain't nothing like this. There really is not anything like this at all. Oh man, that was freaking awesome. So that being said, stay tuned for the second round of the Second Writers Survival All Star Tournament coming soon. That being said, I will catch you guys later.